Hello, hello, welcome to my channel. This is a cross stitch channel where I talk about cross stitch projects, flosses, fabrics, and topics related to cross stitch. If this is your first time here in my channel, welcome. I hope you enjoy uh, the content, and if you like, you can subscribe and click um, the, the bell and and comment I love to read your comments <laughs> um, I am a Mexican teacher I love to share my passion for cross stitch and and yeah um, this is a wonderful community uh, today I am recording this a video this is a, um, a stitch with me video where I stitch and talk with you um, but it's a really special one because I am um, stitching um, a design that I made <laughs> that I create um, and not just that I I made a collaboration with a Spanish magazine, so they uh, published my my design and they um, we we did you know an interview and I talk about uh, my journey as a teacher and you know part of of the of the works that I I have and. Uh, I talk about the, the Mexican retreat and yeah it was um, I'm very very excited because it was a, a lovely experience and I feel uh, really really proud of uh, of this and been able to 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 be in the magazine I I have this uh, memory when I was uh, a, a small uh, child. I, I I went with my mom to to the like the, the farmers market, and they. Uh, I I remember that. Uh, and, and you know a young uh, man a young man um, used to to sell uh, or used yeah to sell this um, European um, magazines um, with with uh, patterns you know knitting patterns and um, sewing patterns and sometimes um, embroidery patterns and they were uh, Italian magazine and also from German and uh, from Spain and it was always uh, a treat when my mom um, got me uh, one of those magazine i to to this day i i already have uh, i i must still <laughs> keep some of of those uh, really really vintage uh, magazines and i love to 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 read those magazines and create uh, something from from their patterns uh, the the cross stitch patterns were uh, you know not the the <laughs> the designs that we stitch <laughs> right now but i i always had that that creative uh, spirit and yeah it it, it was such a um, a fond uh, memory and you know uh, today uh, being 
myself in in one of those magazines and and sharing my my love for cross stitch and um presenting a, a a little design from from me um i feel that connection and that memories again and it was a, a really touching um experience so yeah <laughs> um that's the the design the the project that i'm stitching right now um these are two two mermaids two mermaid mermaids <laughs> um you know um across the ocean uh representing the the mexican or latin american community and the um, european or spanish uh, community and they both are holding um a hoop a little work hoop and yeah it, with a, a lot of of um stitching motifs and i i really want to to represent um something uh traditional from each um country in the case of of the spanish um mermaid with a, a fan and for the mexican mermaid uh, a monarch uh butterfly so i am really happy <laughs> and you know i i decided decided to to start this project and um we we are sharing a hashtag uh so <laughs> if you want to to stitch this this project or or get the 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 magazine the magazine it's a, a lovely uh, magazine with with many other uh designs but i will uh leave the link of the of the page where you can uh get the the digital version of of this uh magazine so yeah <laughs> here i am stitching i am um stitching this uh this project in a uh, a piece of um aida 18 uh, the the color is um rustic rustica <laughs> and i i never um uh i have never stitched on this uh rustic um fabric and it's um a process <laughs> I, I in this space where i already stitch it's a little you know softer and softer and uh, more of my taste but yeah it feels rustic <laughs> so but it's a, a a lovely color and i think the the design um looks really pretty here um i like to add these um like quaker motifs uh representing um like um the the foam or, or the of the ocean like little bubbles and yeah i have here the 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 colors um this is a a card that one of my stitchy friends um gave me in the last um retreat so i i really like to use this this card as um thread holder so i just punch you know the the holes and i have a, a beautiful um thread holder for my projects <laughs> so yeah i i love to to combine this this color one of the mermaid um use these oranges and the other one this this lovely like teal blue green <laughs> color so 
yeah i i really really like it and it's a a really easy um design not not very complicated uh i don't know um as a teacher i i i really <laughs> like to stitch this kind of of clean and um easy <laughs> uh uh projects i mean mirabilia is not especially an, an easy project to stitch but yeah i i mean as a stitcher i i like to have these um, big blocks of colors or or really clean and easy motifs to stitch uh, sometimes i like to to stitch more complicated uh, things but yeah <laughs> I, i think this is a a lovely project to work on and of course i'm a little um impartial in my opinion because <laughs> this is my my own uh design and it was published in in the magazine and i'm so happy <laughs> um i was um telling my mom about this and 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 she she asked me for the for the magazine you know the the printed uh version and i said mom but we have to wait because we can get the the digital uh version right right away but the the printed one it's going to to take a, a few weeks and she was like mm, okay <laughs> not very convinced but yeah she's she's really happy for me too and yeah we we have um that uh, memory together uh when when we we got uh, those um really uh antique magazines at the m m market but yeah I am stitching this part of her hair and um, and I really want to to finish this part. I need to to finish the the uh crosses here because I'm using the the Danish, Danish method so only stitching a half of the of the cross and then I will um came back and finished the the upper um stitch <laughs> but i really want to to start with her uh, uh tail and the the fan here um so yeah <laughs> this is my my project for for these days i really hope to to finish um this design uh soon you know before the 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 next um uh, retreat because uh some of my my stitchy friends are already stitching you know this this project and we all want to to show uh this this finish on the on the retreat so yeah really happy about that so i i have to keep going keep going <laughs> and also finish um a few other projects that i really want to to finish <laughs> for the retreat but yeah and also <laughs> i have to keep uh, getting uh, things ready you know the organization and a lot of of details and and things to do so yeah <laughs> but i really enjoy um stitching and these few moments where i can um take uh, a seat in my in my chair and take these lovely flosses 
and this fabric and spent a few hours um, creating something pretty <laughs> so yeah I, I will worry later <laughs> but yes this is my my quick video for today just a quick hello um, telling you about the magazine about uh, this project and if you like to to get the magazine I will put the, the link in the description box and I will keep stitching and and having fun so thank you for for being here thank you for for sharing um, these moments with me I hope you have a great week stitch a lot enjoy your time stitching creating these these memories uh, and I will see you in my next video take care of yourself take care of your family bye bye